our two countries and for our government to recognize India as a tribe in Kenya, um, it just says there's so much history there. So how did Indians first come to Kenya? You know, it's a, uh, it's a long story. Okay. Uh, Indians began to come to what is now Kenya uh -huh. even before the so-called European exploration. Oh, it was centuries ago that Indians had maritime links with people in this part of the world. Uh -huh. And then came the European exploration. Right. But in more recent times, it was uh, the British, you know, during the British rule when Indians were brought in large numbers. Yes. And I think the first wave of Indians, uh, you know, called by the British was uh, around 1895-96, when Indians were brought to uh, Mombasa right. uh, to begin construction of Mombasa, Uganda uh, railways. Right. And uh, uh, after that, uh, a large number of Indians uh, made Kenya home. Mm. And, and uh, you know, today, uh, you know, sometimes yes. uh, I, I get surprised that uh, you know, we come across uh, Indians of, uh, I mean, Kenyans of Indian region yes. here in this beautiful country, yeah. uh, fifth generation, sixth generation, and, and uh, they are so happy and so well integrated yes. in the Kenyan society. So there's a long history. You're right. Uh, but, um, uh, you know, uh, Kenyans of Indian origin have yeah. been uh, a great asset yeah. uh, to us. Mm. I like that. And also have to recognize the fact that um, our industry, our economy is, is strong because of Indian industrialists, you know, in this country as well. That spirit of entrepreneurism, um, business, Indians have that mindset of just wanting to succeed no matter what. And you see businesses for many generations, handing over, handing over, handing over. Is it an, a cultural thing in India? Uh, I would say uh, yes. Uh, the spirit of enterprise mm -hmm is, is uh, I would say very very uh, Indian and right. it's very visible in this country mm. uh, but the role of uh, Indian industry or uh, people of uh, Indian de yes. descent uh, who have worked uh, so hard uh, in, in uh, nation building of this country I think it uh, began uh, when they first arrived yes. in uh, Kenya and they had the opportunities yeah. they had all the support uh, and uh, such affectionate welcome yes. by the Kenyan society that they could do what they did. Mm. And, and uh, now we are very pleased to see uh, the role played by Indians, yes. the Indian industry, the business community yes. uh, in, in Kenya's nation building. Mm. And uh, you know, they have also served as uh, uh, a very uh, important yeah. uh, bridge between yeah. India and Kenya, yeah. uh, you know, adding a lot to a larger relationship. That is true. Hmm. So for Kenya to recognize um, India as a 44th tribe here, uh, do you know first Swahili? Yes. You do? No, no. Oh, I wish I did. <laughs> I wish I did. Yeah, yeah. even the basic <laughs> Habari, Asante. Habari, those, Asante Sana. You know those Asante ones? Because at least yeah. I know Namaste. No. I know Didi. You know, I, I know some words eh? basically because we've been exposed to some Indian Bollywood content here. Yeah. So that's that's also huge because I actually am told or rather I've read that Bollywood is more lucrative than Hollywood. Is that true? Would you know? Uh, I won't say no. Okay. I don't, I, I won't be able to, uh, you know, back up my answer with, <laughs> okay. with statistics. Okay. But uh, the very fact that mm -hmm. uh, uh, Bollywood is so very popular. Yes. And, um, you know, many Indians, uh, you know, aspire to be Bollywood stars. Yes. Uh, I think there must be a lot of truth in mm. what you're saying. <laughs> I like that sounded very 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 well said <laughs> so and speaking of our similarities as well so yes I've been to India Delhi Hyderabad Mumbai my best was Mumbai and uh, the street food it reminded me of Mombasa in the evenings where again the street food concept is there so one of our similarities as well so what would you speak to how Indian food has gelled into Kenyan culture and vice versa. Uh, I think Indian food uh, is not only popular in Kenya, but uh, some of uh, the elements of Indian cuisine have been so well integrated. Yeah. I'll, I'll uh, you know, recall an incident. Mm -hmm. uh, many years ago, I happened to be in New York mm -hmm. and um, uh, one of my Kenyan friends invited me home. And uh, he said, uh, today the dinner is uh, Kenyan. Yes. 
Uh, I went there and uh, you know we had uh, chapati, uh, we had Indian style vegetables yes. uh, and you know what's dal uh -huh. uh, and, and of course you know they have all zugali yes. uh, but the table uh, looked very Indian. Yes. So I think it was uh, a very good mix of Kenyan cuisine mm. and also the Indian cuisine how it has been uh, integrated yeah. and adapted into the uh, uh, Kenyan cuisine yes. and, and I think there is a, a lot of uh, commonality yes. uh, between uh, uh, you know our eating habits yes. uh, and, and it largely depends on the locally available stuff mm. uh, but in terms of uh, I think our tastes uh, to me you know they are fairly similar. Yeah.